Hello, today we are going to learn how to draw the yin-yang symbol. Yin-yang refers to a concept originating in ancient Chinese philosophy where opposite forces are seen as interconnected and counterbalancing. It is commonly represented by the yin-yang symbol, a circle made up of black and white swirls, each containing a spot of the other. So the first step is to mark a point in the center of your page. And setting your compass with a radius of 8 centimeters, we are going to draw a circle in a thicker line, as shown here. So to continue, we are going to draw a vertical diameter. And we are going to divide this vertical diameter into four parts. To do this, we are going to set the compass to the same radius as the circle, and centering on the top side of the vertical diameter, we scribe two arcs which cut the circumference at two points as can be seen here. Now we are going to repeat this process from the bottom end of the vertical diameter obtaining another two points on the circumference. So now, setting the ruler between our previously scribed points on the circumference, we obtain two new points on the vertical diameter, which you can see here. So now you can see that we have divided the vertical diameter into four equal sections or parts. These two new points are going to be the center points of two new semicircles, which we are going to draw. So now, setting the compass on the first point, and with a radius of 4 cm, we are going to scribe a semicircle in a thicker line to the left. And now, with the same radius and setting the compass on the bottom point, we are going to scribe another semicircle, this time to the right in a thicker line, joining up with the previous semicircle as shown here. So now, with the same center point and a radius of 1 cm, we are going to draw a circle in a thicker line, as shown. You may have noticed that this small circle is 1 is to 8, the size of the large circle. So if you want to draw bigger or smaller yin-yang symbols, you must always maintain the 1 is to 8 proportionality between the large circle and the small circle. Okay, so now we are going to draw another circle with the same radius 1 cm on the top. And the only step left is to shade in one of the sides in black with a white dot and the other in white with a black dot. So now you have the yin yang symbol. I hope this video has helped you. Please press like and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thank you. Until the next video.